Hello everyone. How are you doing? I hope you're doing great. Welcome to my channel, Alexa's Garden. In this video, I want to show you new varieties of roses that I have planted in my garden. Do you like roses? Do you grow roses in your garden? Let's walk together along the garden beds where I grow roses. Rose Julia Child This is an unusual hybrid with a very long flowering. Floribunda Julia Child starts flowering in early summer and ends in mid-autumn. The flower color is yellow. Flower size up to 4 inches or up to 10 centimeters. The distance between the bushes you need when planting and growing these roses is 15 inches or 40 centimeters. Plant height 27 to 33 inches or 70 to 85 centimeters. This rose loves the sun. The flowering period is from June to the end of September. Hybrid Julia Child refers to Terry Roses from the Floribunda class. The hybrid was launched in 2004. The rose has the color of butter and an aroma similar to that of licorice. Julia Child has strong stems, buds are not afraid of bad weather. Yellow lush flowers after the rains become brighter in color. Up to five buds can appear on one branch. The hybrid is resistant to the most common diseases, including powdery mildew. Planting and Cultivation Rose Julia Child looks excellent both as a single plant and in group plantings. This rose is often used in parks to decorate alleys. The plant is not afraid of frost, it is unpretentious in cultivation both in open ground and in containers. Caring for these roses is simple, remove wilted flowers and old shoots to encourage reblooming. Rose Floribunda Main Munchen The color of flower is multicolored. Distance between bushes when planting 15 inches or 40 centimeters. Plant height 23 to 30 inches or 70 to 80 centimeters. This rose loves the sun. The flowering period is from May to late September. Main Munchen is a noble rose that belongs to the Floribunda group. The variety was bred in 1987 in Scotland. This rose has an elegant form of flowers and bright color. The flowers are medium in size, double, and have a weak aroma. Each flower has three colors, yellow and orange inside the flower, and red on the edges of the petals. The flower size is about 3 inches or 8 centimeters. The flowers appear in early summer. 
The bush grows evenly and compactly. He is medium tall, with straight strong shoots. The main munchen variety is characterized by unpretentiousness and high frost resistance, the plant is not demanding in care. The rose blooms very profusely, but with short breaks throughout the season. The best place to plant is in full sun or partial shade. This variety of roses can also be grown as a houseplant and in small garden areas. Frost resistance is low minus 4 degrees Fahrenheit or minus 20 degrees Celsius. Rose looks great as a single plant in flower beds, borders, and flower beds. The variety is ideal for cutting. The plant is resistant to fungal diseases. Rose care. Fertilization and top dressing of these plants are required. The rose needs pinching, you need to form bushes and remove weak shoots and wild shoots. Most roses need shelter for the winter. Before you cover the roses, you should remove all flowers and leaves, and green shoots. I usually spud the growing point of the bush with soil and cover it with leaves or mulch on top. Shoots of Vermontant, climbing roses should be tilted to the ground and covered with insulating materials. In the spring, the shelter should be removed. For better growth and flowering of roses, I recommend using complex mineral fertilizers for roses of prolonged action. Thank you for watching. I hope this video was helpful and interesting for you. If you liked the video, don't forget to give a thumbs up at the bottom and subscribe to my channel. See you later.